Hello everyone, it's the UpForm team over here and today we're going to show you guys how you can start better using SurveyMonkey to create forms. Specifically for today, we're going to show you guys how you can start limiting responses when let's say you've hit a certain amount. Now this is really great for when you want to limit certain collector URLs to a specific number of responses seeing as it can get pretty hard to handle more than 100 responses on one account if you're unorganized or you don't have everything set up yet. So. This is just an intro on how to limit your responses. Okay, so let's just first head over to the form that we want to start limiting responses on. In this case, we're going to go to the general form for all of our stores. We're just going to click that. And as you can see, we, we already have this form open. We already have a few responses. And while we're pretty happy with the design, as you can see over here, we've completed all the questions we wanted and we don't want to make any more changes in that regard. We want to limit how many responses we're getting because we're worried that we might be getting too many. So let's just head over to the collect responses tab, which is right after the preview and score. And from here, you're going to see how many survey collectors you have. Currently, we only have one link up that's currently receiving responses. And while we do not have a lot of responses yet, we want to limit this one to, let's say, 50. So now that we're here, let's head over to the rightmost side of our web link too, where you're going to see a three dot button. And from here, you can see that you can actually edit your collector. So let's just edit it really quickly. So this will bring you to the editors page where you can basically see everything in regards to messing around with the link of this form. And while we have gone over most of these features, we are now going to open this show advanced options link. So it's going to show us more options. And here, if you were to zoom in a little bit here, you can see that there is a response limit option. So if you were to turn this on, you can then limit your responses to a specific number. And in this case, because you already have a pre-existing set of responses already inside our database, we can't go any lower than six because then obviously SurveyMonkey would be forced to delete and we can't do that. It would mess with the results. So let's go with 50 in this case. Okay. so. In this case, also before we save this change, just know that you can also edit the survey closed message here, seeing as let's say, oh, the survey's currently closed. We've hit our, our maximum amount of responses and there we go. So now we can also edit the closed message over here, hit save. And since we already turned it on, all we gotta do is head back to the link and see if this should work. So honestly, we can't really hit 50 responses right now, but just know that you don't have to click anything in regards to that save button when it comes to changing this feature. As you can see, we're just heading back here to show you that it actually saved and we didn't have to click anything other than toggling it on and adding our number in. And that's all you really have to say about this. Hopefully this helps you better manage any sort of data collection you might be doing. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Be sure to like and subscribe. And if you need any more help when it comes to Survey Monkey. Be sure to check out the rest of our channel using either the link on the upright corner of this video or any of the links below. See you next time!